Motherfucker, you call little cross. King of the madhouse, gone too soon. Motherfucker, you touch it, touch it, touch it. Ah, motherfucker, motherfucker you. you! Motherfucker you, touch it, Mr. Carlito Cross. Motherfucker you. M motherfucker, motherfucker you. yeah, motherfucker you. All right, we're here. I'm late. I was I was putting a grill together and I lost track of time. I was putting my new grill together and you can fucking deal with it. I've been putting a lot of shit together. I put the new chair together. Uh, we're no longer in low rider mode. The chair the chair is up. It's up riding high. So that we got that. I got a big fucking grill in my <laughs> out in my living room. It's heavy, and and for the fucking the lid the the the, 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 go, the goddamn the goddamn hinges are binding. So I got to deal with that tomorrow. But other than that, it's together. It only it only took me like an hour and a half. We're uh, talking charcoal or gas here, buddy. Uh, propane is a flat top grill. Uh, propane. Oh. It's a three burner okay. flat flat top motherfucker that I can do a bunch of shit on. And uh, uh, yeah. once I get it, uh, your pants are hard right now. I don't know what you're doing with your life. That turns me on. <laughs> once Remember I get it together else. all the way, yeah, I gotta, I gotta season it. I got the seasoning shit for it. And you can bend you right over that thing. Got your nice you front out there. Now I like the high rider machine and definitely some bad beats with the trap too. Yeah. Hey, yeah, that was a. Uh, that, that was one that Ax Axpa wrote the lyrics for it, and we've done several instances of it. I do like that one. It's kind of a banger, you know? It's got all that bass and shit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hard. It hits it hits you right in, right in the pants. Uh, feel it down in your boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> right? I, I've got absolutely nothing planned. I, like I said, I... I was out all well. I were I was at work uh, this morning, and then this afternoon I was out from like one until like I don't know six thirty seven o'clock, and then I came home and immediately started putting the grill together, <laughs> and and I was like ah I got just a few more steps, and then I started looking at the drive. I'm like what the fuck does this mean? And uh, then I, I you know I figured it out, and and now it's almost together. I just I got one more thing I got to do. I'm gonna have to do some bending of the of the hinges. Not a big deal. Okay. But it's, it's gonna All be ready to go. All the instruction lit goes on the bottom. <laughs> but there's no the words. It's just the... arrows pointing at shit. Like, did, did the battery <laughs> fuck with you for the igniter, bud? Did the battery fuck with you for the igniter? Uh, I haven't. I no? I put the battery I... in, but I didn't uh, click clickety clack it. Uh, it should it should got, be got, okay. Got, well, it should be okay because I put uh, okay. uh, <laughs> I took the I took that... the wrapping the plastic wrapping off the battery that they tried to sneak on there. I was like, oh oh <laughs> no. Yeah. Me. All right. I'm, uh, I do have big announcements. Next week's show, yes. that's going to be the Dwight birthday show. Yeah, yeah it's coming next weekend. And we're going to we're gonna celebrate. And we're going to demand free shit from every, everybody next week. We're going to be like, hey, it's my birthday. Give me free <laughs> shit. That's always fun. Nice. It's like, hey, it's, it's my birthday. Give me, give me, give it now. Also. What's that? 
Is it my ass or or I can't hear with many people talking all at once here. Go ahead, Turbo. The floor is yours. Is the honor to honor uh, 420 show as well? Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, that is well. That actually, that will be on Saturday. Uh, my birthday will be uh, the day after. So when we end the show, it'll be my birthday. Uh, so let's see here. I'm gonna pull up. Um, what city? What city should we call? Uh, England. Uh, no, no, no. We can't do that. We can't do that. My machine. Uh, let's see here. Um, yeah, everybody tells Milkman happy birthday all the time, but I actually be Milkman's birthday. Or my birthday. What are you like, 38? <laughs> I'm going to be 75. I'm going to be 70. I look good for 75. Uh, <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Criminal <laughs> uh, you. Okay, let's go to. I guess we'll go to this city and we'll find a place to call. Yeah, yes, yes. I don't know how to say your fucking name, but yes, Milkman is here. That is uh, indeed the Milkman. Um, or, or, or Lechero, if you're a little Spanish. That's right. Uh -huh. I learned that from watching Prison Break. Very, very good series. The whole a whole Panama series. They were, they were like Lechero. All right. So let's grab that. Let's grab, uh, grab our penis. Uh, I mean, let's take that back. No, no penis grabbing yet. Uh, we're just, we're just going to dial. I didn't do the intro because I was late, you know. So technically with the intro, we're only about 15 minutes late, so. Here we go. People are saying they grabbed their penis enough. Oh, shit. I got to start the poll for movie night, too. Mother shit. God. I don't know why Cat doesn't do that. I mean, what does she do around here? I can't do it, stupid. Uh, uh okay. You're in charge of movie stuff. Uh, poll. Your call has been time. forwarded to voicemail. The person minutes. you're trying to reach is not uh, available. Size At the time, please 10. record your message. When Multiple you have votes. finished recording, you may hang up. Hello? Hi, I can't hang up on you right now because I'm trying to run a movie poll real quick. Uh, so so never 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 mind me. I'm just driving and, and starting a movie poll right now. Got my knee on the wheel and, and, and I'm on my way. I'm, I'm on my way right now. That might have been a mistake. All right, here we go. I got the poll up. Uh, your movie poll uh, options are Hancock, American Psycho 2, All American Girl, uh, The Road, Mr. Magoo, The Game, The Fugitive. Man, it's like every movie Turbo ever fucking nominated. <laughs> the fu I the fugitive. I cock for a second. No, yeah, Hancock, Hancock. Uh, Triple X, uh, Trap House, Office Christmas Party, and Ernest Goes to Jail, uh, which follows up. We watched Ernest in the Army last week. Terrible film, horrible. Just, just one of the worst. One of the worst ever. I like the cultural subtext. I don't know. I I don't know. It was it was bad though. Uh, but I don't think it was as bad. What was the first movie? Oh, was that the one we watched? Get out of my room, the Cheech and Chong movie. Oh, yeah. that that was horrible. Well, that was, fucking that was awful. fifty-three minutes of a music video that needed to be yeah, about two geez. minutes. It's like behind the yep. <laughs> behind the music type shit, and it was terrible. I mean, I've seen some good Cheech and Chong movies, but that one I've never seen. That one I was like, oh, we're in for a treat, and I was like, holy shit! <laughs> I feel like I want to overdose on marijuana. We were I was just like, oh. Thank you for calling Motel 6 Arlington. How may I help you today? Uh, yes, I'm calling about a friend in uh, room 215, please. May I know his name, sir? His name is Asshole. A X E L A X E O L E Axol. Hello? Yes, hello. There is nobody in the 215 room. Okay, where, what room would he be in then? I don't know, sir. Okay, are you always a marachod or what? Ah, ah, you would, you would hang up. You would be like that. <laughs> Got a copy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I, I just flipped right into an accent, but, you know, that's not right. That wasn't, that wasn't intended to be racist, I'm going to say. It's a modified do-right. <laughs> <laughs> Middle Eastern do-right. It's Middle Eastern do-right. <laughs> Without permission. 
We had a park in the room. If I, if I sit like this, it makes it look like I got muscles. Thank you for calling Flags Motel. If you know your party's room number, please dial it now Ooh. or dial zero for operator. How about 111? Please hold. Boy, that actually lady has personality. I might get a little loopy. I've been up since about 7 this morning. Yes. Hi, is this room Hello? 111? Yes, room 11, yeah. Hi, hi. This is Dwight calling from the uh, the front desk. From where? The front desk. Of the hotel. Oh, next door, you said? No, I, I work at the front desk of the, of the motel. Oh, at the front door. Yes, yes, that's me. Um, listen, yeah. here, here at the Flags Motel, uh, we've, doc we've documented that you, uh, during your stay, have yet to kiss another man. Uh, maybe we ask why? No. I mean, I, I really don't. I really am confused. I'm not well, you're, really staying, you're, staying, here, what, you're what, staying here with us at the Flags Motel. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm a staying at the Flags Motel, yeah. Yeah. Well, what, you know, that's how we got our name is when, when you stay here, uh, we're very friendly towards uh, people of the same sex. And I, I assume that, I mean, I don't mean to assume, but you're a gentleman. Um, so it's in our charter when you sign in that you have to kiss another man at least once a day while you stay here. I'm the same by myself. Right. You need to go next door. We'll send a man and you will you go ahead and you will present your lips and he will kiss you. Wait, when? Uh, well, do you have time now? I'll, well, you listen. I'll come to I'll come to room eleven, um, and in the doorway, um, I want you. I will kiss you on the lips, and then I will pop. I will pop my ankle in the air, like one of those romantic cartoons. <laughs> well, I mean, I was about, I was about to to. I mean, someone is picking me picking me over. Like I don't know. They don't know. They're on their way. Is it a man? No, no, no. Is a woman? Oh, is a, my friend a girl? A girl? A, a girl? No, that's yeah. not. That's not going to yeah. work. You got to. You got to kiss a man. Does no. she? Does she have a no. mustache? No, <laughs> no. How no. long have How long have you known this person? Well, oh, she's texting me. She's well, well, she's texting. She's texting you for a few years. Okay, are you yeah, yeah, are you romantic? Are you romantic together? No, not really. He's my friend. Just a, just a no. friend. Okay. Well, I want to yeah. come. How long until yeah. she gets there? Hmm? How long until she gets there? Like, she says to me, maybe she's like about to pull up or something. Okay, well, I'm going to run down there from the front desk real quick, and I want to touch mustaches with you. You want to? What, what? I want to touch my mustache to your mustache. <laughs> no, no, I'm good, man. I'm good. No, no, you have to. You can't stay here unless, no, no, unless you kiss another man. No, no man, I'm good. Okay, you touch I'm an, good. Listen, you touch another man in the pants, and that's all you got to do for the no, entire stay. No, no, yeah. no, no, man, I'm good. But I have candy down here. Thank you. I have candy in my Thank pants. You. I'm good, man. I'm no, good. no, Thank you're you. not. No, I'm gonna kick you the fuck out. That's why I love him. <laughs> I do like this place. Is you could just fucking dial right on in. <laughs> all right, let's yeah, get his. Awesome. Yeah. Sure was tickled. <laughs> He liked he it. They're it. hard to come by these days, though, eh? Oh, the dial ins? Yeah. Usually because we've destroyed them all and they took away that, that yeah. right. Thank you for yeah. calling Flags Motel. If... Please hold. Please hold. Loves her job. Loves it. She's She'll she'll stay there for eternity. Man, I fucking sliced several fingers putting that fucking grill together. Those edges were sharp. <laughs> fucking hurts. I mean, I immediately went in and washed my hands and fucking hit it with peroxide. I was like, ah, it didn't bleed like crazy. It's almost on the level of paper cut. Like, you know, those piece of shit. Oh. Hello? Come on. You're holding that, that, that shirt. And I don't shit. I don't know. Uh, 
I don't know what the dial Thank in. Thank you for calling Flagmo. Yeah, I'm just going to get the I'm going for the front desk this time. Please hold. Hang on. She sounds like that one lady expert. I can't buy a mind. That lady. Cat's favorite. Snake Hi, is this the front desk? Yes. Hey, somebody just called me in room 11, and they told me if I was going to stay at, the, at this motel that I had to kiss a man every night that I stay here. Who? Someone said they were from the front desk and said that in order for me to stay here, every night I stay here, I have to kiss a man. Who? I, you, probably. I don't know what's going on. Who was it? It doesn't sound like you. It was someone else. So who called you? They said they worked at the front desk. Nobody working at the front desk here. Okay, well, who is you is? Who are you? I stay in room 11. Motherfucker. You are room, num room number 11? Yes, motherfucker, you. I fucker you too. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> well? Eh. Yeah, it's all right. Maybe he'll just talk to the guy in 11. <laughs> God sent everyone to 11, but like... Well, 12, I mean, 12 was wasn't answering, so... Uh, that guy, you know, he, he can't have a conflict with a guy in 11. He's leaving to go get some vagina from a girl he's been texting for years. That's what he does, baby. I feel like she identifies as a male from Texas. Could be. Could fucking be. Ugh. Uh, and I don't know what the throne alert is t uh, tonight. I didn't change it, so whatever it was last week, I, f I forget. Red Roof and Hogan, how can I help you? Hi, is this a Red Roof? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm calling... You know where Flags... The Flags Motel is over here? The Flags? Yeah, Flags. The Flags Motel? Uh, no, sir. Over here on East Division Street? Okay, well, I just sent my associate over to you. I, I, I work for the Flag Motel. I sent the, my associate over there with a bunch of dirty clothes with bed bugs in them, and then he's throwing them in your hallway. I'm from the Red Roof, sir. I know. I sent my associate with, with bed bug ridden with sheets and shit stains, and I told him to rifle those motherfuckers in your hallway, and that's what he's doing right now. Why? What do you mean, why? Like, why? Like, why, can you, cuz? Because you're stealing our business. I'm not understanding, yeah, what you're trying to say. Okay. Do you know bed bugs? Yeah. You have now. Okay, thank you. Bye. <laughs> he's down. I, I can't turn him up any higher. It's just, he's just, he's just mumbling. He's just, he's just being a, a mumbling motherfucker is what he's doing. Uh, I might be able to, let me look at something. Might be able to do a little something. Maybe that'll do. Uh, we can. Yeah, all right, let's get that a shot. Uh, and if you're a part of the Patreons, you should have got a nice, <laughs> a nice little Facebook live trolling the other night. This lady, it was funny, man. She, she was, she was, she was live streaming all over the place. And then she turned it to a checkers, and we were able to determine what checkers she was at. And by the time she got through the drive-thru, we were on the phone with the people at the drive-thru trying to add on to her order. It's good stuff. Compelling stuff. It's in the Patreon. Checkers like O'Reilly's? Like yeah, like a... ra rallies, checkers, depend on where you live. It's the same oh, shit. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, but, gotcha. yeah, the lady's like, you could... <laughs> She's ordering on the drive-thru speaker, and you could hear the phone ringing... <laughs> Through the drive through while she's ordering. <laughs> and she pulled up. They're like, are you so-and-so? She's like, yeah. She's like, your son Michael wants to know if you can add on a big Buford to your order. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I mean, it, was, it was great because the sharp eyes of Axma and then the fucking triangulation by uh, the tap-tap-draw-draw draw artist. We were able to narrow down where the fuck she was at. And we called and tried to add on some shit to the order. Yeah, the house, of, the house of Wonder knows. I sent it to the House of Wonder. The House of Wonder was fucking like, that's ah, some good shit. Oh, boy. Yeah, it was good. It was good. Oh, wait a minute. Why the fuck am I trying to dial in there? That's not going to go anywhere. 
fingers. Feel like an old woman, like, like in Happy Gilmore that fingers started hurting from doing all the quilting and now my back's going to hurt from getting landscaping duty. Thanks for calling Silicon Arlington. Thank you. Hello? Yeah, hi. Hello? I'm in the hotel. Yes, sir. Yes. I'm not a guest here, but I'm in the hotel. What was the room number, sir? No, I'm not a guest. I don't have a room, but I'm in the hotel. Okay. So, so what happens when I'm not a guest in the hotel and then I do this? What what happens? Uh, I just want you to come from if you want the room, you can come to the front desk. But this room's broken. Sorry. Somebody broke the room. See, look. Look, the room's broken. Look at this. Breaking. Everything's broke. I don't want this room. This room's broken. I want a different room. What was the room number? I don't know what room number this is. It's not my room. I'm sorry. From what room you're calling, sir? Uh, the, I don't know. It's in. I do you have rooms here? Hey, don't hang up. Don't. Don't do it. Ah. I'm just looking at the pictures. This is a real, real scummy place. Yo. Know, the type, the type of place you might see when you go to like you know Universal Studios in uh, in Florida or something, you know. But you know, at least they didn't have bullet holes in the lobby windows and um, just mm -hmm. water dripping from the ceiling and the walls. The walls were sweating. They were like Mike Tyson mm -hmm. at a goddamn spelling bee. They were they were under pressure. All right, all right, that's fine. It's okay. That's okay. Let me close that out, and let's go again. You know, the type of place where rumors get spread about you being fucking hobo stabbed. Oop, 800 number. Not doing that. Get on, get on out of here. <laughs> I'm, about, uh, I'm about to do an inside jokey joke here in a second. All right, dial. Time for the Carlito song. I can't. Icarus yelled at me last week, man. I can't be making songs. I'll make so I'll make songs, I guess, about the calls after the fact and put them in the edit. Thanks for calling. Want to see How can I help you? Yeah. Hi. I I did something very bad in my room. What happened, sir? I I got angry. I was watching the basketball games, and my team lost. Um, I was I was rooting for the uh, the basketball t players that played for the Los Angeles Angels, and they lost. And then and then so I kicked the door. I kicked the motherfucking door and blew it right off its hinges. Oh, oh, you broke the door. Yeah, right off its fucking hinges. Okay, what's your room number? Hang on, I recorded it. I'm gonna. I want you to hear this because it wasn't totally my fault. Here, listen to this. And that, and, and that right there is when it came off the hinges. Okay. I don't think the screws were in all the way because it came off right off the right off the the motherfucking hinges like really easy. Okay, okay, sir. Okay, I mean, I need to know your room number, and I have to. See, you see, uh, hang on, hang on a second. Look at this mirror; looks weird. There's, there's somebody looking back at me in the mirror. They're on the phone too. We got a problem, boy. We got a problem, motherfucker. Motherfuck, motherfuck, shit. Take that. Gah, gah, blah, gah. Ah. Oh. What? He just threw a turkey at me. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. What are you? What's going on? Why do you have my grandmother's clock? Hello? Yes, I hear you. Yes, sir. Which room are you in? I'm in 215. 215? Yeah. Okay. Sure, sir. But why, what happened? Why? Why did this happen? Why? I don't know. You don't know? What do you, what do you know, Marachod?
That's bullshit. Uh, uh, Royce, I'll, I'll, I'll check on it. I'll check on it, okay? I'll check on it afterwards. I'll check on it. You'll get an update afterwards. Don't you worry. Don't don't you mother mother effing worry. You learned so much Indian from us. Ah, ah, come on. Don't say that. Don't 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 say this is an educational channel. Come on. Let's not. Come on. Let's not ruin it. Let's not let's not do that. I feel like we need someone on your channel that does sign language. Or monochode and monochode. Uh, what? Well, closed captioning. I think you just turn closed captioning on. I'm not sure it's going to translate monochode, but... Holiday Inn Express, how can I help you? Hi, how are you? Good, what can I do for you? Um, well, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to... <sighs> I did something, and I'm not proud of it. And I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to get it back. Okay. I t uh, boy. So my son, he's in a, he's in a wheelchair. We're in 115. Um, he was acting up. He was he was actively rooting against a baseball team that I was watching. And I threw the uh, padlock to his wheelchair through the wall. And I don't know how to get it. In 115? Yes. Okay, give me a moment and I'll come right down. Okay. I do I do want I do want to mention that his chair was still attached to it. Uh so he is in the wall as well. What? Yeah. He's like half in, half out, but I, I don't have enough power to to pick him up. He's a he's a real fat bastard with a helmet. But I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know if you can help me or what. But he's half in, half out. To get a nice what out of her. Not much else. All right. Let's see here. Give me a second. I'm gonna switch locations on this. Uh, yes. Let's go here. Go there. And then I want to go to. I want to go here for some of this. No, that's okay. I was about to say that's not what I hit. Thank you. So, how's everybody's weekend? Did we have a good weekend so far? Is this, is this what we do? How we do? Where we do? Wawa wah do? My Thank you for calling your local Waffle House. To place a to-go order, please visit order.wafflehouse.com oh as we are oh, no longer accepting to-go orders over the phone. We look forward to seeing okay, you soon. Gotcha. They're no longer accepting to-go orders, but will I still be able to speak to someone? You've made an invalid selection. Well, well, fuck you then. See, so, yeah, I think to we're gonna. Answer your question. My weekend's awesome. How awesome? Uh, out of ten, solid five, five and three quarter stars. Okay, all right, all right. I see Royce over here says they watched the new Kung Fu Panda. It was okay, and it woke up, so it was good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I watched the new Ghostbusters last weekend. Thank was, you for calling your local right. Waffle House. Okay. To place a to-go order, please visit order.wafflehouse.com as we are no longer accepting... Yeah, damn, we can't even call to a Waffle House. They don't even give you the option to speak with anyone anymore. Yeah, that's hard. I well, think be, I broke that well, you. Well, before, they used to used to call a few, and they might let you uh, through eventually. Usually get the message like, oh, well, we're helping other guests. Now they're just like, no, we ain't even gonna, we ain't even gonna do that shit. Uh, I'll tell you, in Kentucky, Tennessee, those southern states still occasionally will let you through but yeah i think i broke the system a few years ago buddy uh yeah i don't even know uh i saw civil war i heard that oh yeah i heard the premise of that it's not really a political thing it's uh like each state for themselves type of shit trying to take over the country type stuff uh which i know a lot of people said that they were pretty 
uh, they were pretty happy they didn't really go political on it with the Civil War. They were just like, ah, oh, it's just each state fucking pissed off. And they're like, hey, fuck it, I'm, we're taking over. And trying to make a march to D.C. or some shit. And like some states were safe zones and some were not. Like some were in it and some were just like, ah, fuck you guys. You know, that type of shit. There is one up movie out that we talked about. We need to watch once it uh, gets a good copy called Monkey Man. That one looked pretty good. Looked pretty decent. You know, new new movie. Right up new new's butthole. Thank you for calling your local Waffle House. All right, let's see if this if one does it. To go order, please visit. I don't think so. I switched states. Let's see. As we are no longer. Yep, they're they're doing that company wide now. All right, so let's scrap that. And let's see. And let's do. Uh, let's make sure they're open. I don't want to just call some shit that's not open. What the fuck is this? Godzilla is at least five times bigger than that monkey bitch. Uh, you're, oh, you're on, you're on Godzilla's side. Ew. Matthew Broderick had him killed in the first one. Okay. And if you get killed by Matthew Broderick, you deserve to stay dead. When Ferris Bueller kills you, not, you're dead. Not canonically, uh, Godzilla is supposed to be like 500 feet tall. Thank you for calling Dudley's on short. This is Keen. Hi, can I make an order, please? Um, yes, let me patch you through. Give me one second. All right. Damn, they close in seven minutes. I was hoping they'd tell me no. I'm not cuss them out. Thank you for holding. What can I get for you? Uh, can I get the uh, Brussels sprout salad? Yeah. Is and, that all? Oh, uh, no. Then I'm going to get the eggs benedict. I, I cannot do brunch right now. Um, that's only Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from 11 a.m. to 2.30. Okay. So we still got time. It's, it's only going on 11. Oh, so you can't do it until 11. Tomorrow morning. 2.30? You said 2.30? That is tomorrow morning, 2 yeah. 2.30 p.m. I do brunch from Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from 11 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. That is a brunch. We are at our dinner service right now. Okay, I'll take a halibut. Um, that is That that was a special. I do not have any halibut. Okay, I'll take... Uh, you got crab cakes? I do. All right, crab cake it up. How many do you want? I have the the portion has one crab cake, uh -huh. but it's a very very large like honestly like kind of thick crab cake. Like how uh, how many does an average person able to eat in the one sitting? Um, honestly, usually one. How many can you put inside your fat gullet? What was that? How many can you put inside your fat gullet? Inside my fat what? Gullet, your fucking mouth. Over here, tell me I can't get brunch trying to force some bullshit on me. You cannot get brunch during dinner, how, sir. I'm ah, sorry. How big's your belly? Show me your belly. Okay. You're, I'm going to hang up because our kitchen closes in three minutes. That's okay. I got three minutes to make an order then. All right, let's figure this out. I, let me get a I'm, lamb, let me get a lamb I, shake. I, okay. Well, I will not have someone talk to me like that. Why are you crabby? Did you eat all the crab and you're all crabby? Okay, goodbye. Do you want your do you want your takeout ah, order? Or I'm going to McDonald's. Okay, good. No, nah, good to you. Oh, damn. Yeah, McDonald's got better good food hours than them. She's a she's a mean person. She was not a nice person. I'll tell you that. She just cries. Yeah, I still forgot. I forgot to produce last week's edited video. Put it on YouTube. I got to do that for tomorrow. After I get done with the show while I'm waiting to do download this show, I'll run the uh, video uh, rendering of that one and get that uploaded while I'm waiting on the other one. Uh, a lot of these places close in three minutes. Good. There's opportunities here. There's opportunities for shit. 
Hello, and thank you for calling Hi. Whiskey Bear Craft Kitchen and Bar. Please press 1 for business hours and directions. No. Press 2 to book a private party or event. No. Press 3 to make a reservation. No. Press 4 to speak with a team member. Yeah. Or press... I won't do that. Hello? 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 Hi. Can I make an order, please? Uh, we are actually closed, sir. Oh, then why'd you answer the phone, motherfucker? Waste my motherfucking oh, wow. wasting my goddamn time. I'm drunk. I'll get the fuck off my ah, line, get off my line. I get swear to line. I swear yeah. to God, I'll strangle you with a T-bone. <laughs> I'll make you eat it first. Ah. I don't know. Let's see if I can get back through to him if he'll argue some more. But I do hit four. <laughs> Four or five. Hello, and thank you for calling. If you can't find no business, please. I'm hungry. I'm hungry, motherfucker, you. Uh, okay, well, go and find it somewhere else. I'm sorry. Listen, listen. I'll gobble your dick if you make me some food. Please, come on. What? I tried to sweet talk him. Oh boy. Did you just say gobble your dick? Yeah, he makes me some food, I'll gobble his dick. <laughs> I don't know why that cracks me up, but uh, he, yeah. he needs he needs uh he needs to be better. He's I hope he owned the place because if you were just a worker there answering the phone, you're probably getting fired. <laughs> I feel like we need a Dwight the janitor shirt that just says gobble that D. I don't think you'd be able to wear that in public. Maybe at Publix. You could probably wear it there. The person you have dialed can't take your call now. Oh, well, that's a shame. They don't have them where you're at, you know? A, a Publix? A pu Publix? Down, a Publix? Down south they might. Yeah, I think they do down there. With their curs or their food lions and such. Food lions? Hey, and yeah. Yeah, I think food lions a fucking thing down there, I believe. I a, could be wrong. A though. lion that eats food? <laughs> Waffle no. House? No, Waffle food House. <laughs> oh, Cracker Barrel. Kro Kruger? Yeah. I think it's called Kruger. Let's, uh, let's move spots. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, Xenorak says it's a thing, yes. He goes, hey, it's a thing, motherfucker. You. No, no. The Xanax is a thing down south, I think. Oh. Oh, no. I believe. <laughs> waffle House, Waffle House, closed, closed, open. <laughs> it's a drive-in? <sighs> okay. I need a massage. My neck is, my neck hurts. It keeps a cracking. I think I'm dying. I'm driving Waffle House, I don't think. Yeah, that's a Thank you for calling house. Universal Orlando Resort. Oh my god. It's time to kick down the gates and let loose with all your favorite people. I kicked down the In fucking Universal gates. In Universal Studios Florida and Universal's Islands of Adventure, be transported into the two wondrously oh. different lands of the wizarding oh. world of Harry Potter. Discover mischief and mayhem with Illumination's minions. Come face to face with the dinosaurs of Jurassic Park and more. Plus, with our seasonal events, there's something to celebrate all year long this from our holiday celebration to the world's premier Halloween event. This guy's really fucking also, excited. experience the ultimate chills and thrills at Universal's Volcano Bay Water Theme Park, where the beach, winding river, and wave pool are always tempting escapes. Top it all off with a stay at one of Universal's amazing hotels, and you'll enjoy exclusive theme park benefits uh, all right, like asshole, early park the admission to breathe let's, let's into one to, of Universal's the parks fucking... an hour earlier than other guests, hey, and being over super me. close to all three parks and Universal City Walk throughout your stay. For more information and to review our new guidelines throughout the resort, like social distancing, health screenings, and sanitizing, please visit that? UniversalOrlando.com or download the official Universal Orlando app. I want to talk to somebody. Press 1 for theme park information. Press 2 for information about theme park tickets, annual passes, and VIP tours. Press 3 for vacation packages and universal hotel information. 
press 4 to make a dining reservation at our theme parks, Universal City Walk, or Universal Orlando Resort Hotel. Press 5 for the Cinemark Theater at Universal Orlando. Press 6 to hear more options. Can I hit 0? Press 1 for theme park information. Press 2 for information about theme park tickets. Right, Press 1 for meetings and corporate events. Press 2 for guest services. To re Thank you for calling guest services at Universal Orlando Resort. Your call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance. Please make your selection for the following list of options. For lost and found, press 1. For ticket information or to purchase <laughs> tickets, press 2. For guest services, press 3. I keep fucking... Thank you for calling Universal Orlando Guest Services. We are open seven days a week from 8.30 a.m. to 7 p.m. We <sighs> care about closed. your concerns and ask that you call back during normal operation. Went through all that bullshit just to find out they're closed. Hi, brother. It's a shitty idea and probably a dick move, but have you ever considered calling, like, AA meetings online? Eh, nah, I don't know why I want to call AA meetings. I know, right? Those are, those are people that kind of actually need help. Yeah, I get it. I get it. It's a dick move. It's a dick move. I get it. I just popped in my noggin. And I was just wondering, because I don't think any of us have ever done that, you know? Uh, I know we've done the the overeaters and stuff, but <laughs> not not, yeah. so, not so much the uh, the other ones. Yeah. The other ones. Yeah. You're right. The overeaters, you just you're like, right. hey, close your motherfucking mouth without food in it, you'll be good. <laughs> but they don't do that. Yeah. And then you start reading the pop tarts ingredients, eating. and they get mad. Goddamn popcorn and pop tarts, you know. Can I ask you one question really quickly? What's that? The, the music bed wasn't in a few. I was getting through the, the tree just fine. It's just they end up getting through about three different times on different menus and then it ended up being closed. Because you went to the guest services and it read off additional options and then it had guest services on that same one again. You start a band tomorrow. What's the name of that band? That's my question. Uh, I don't I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't do bands. I'm not a band. Well, I don't. I don't either. That's why I said it. Like, because I, I like like overeaters. To me, is like that. To me, sounds like a goddamn badass bad name. You know, like I'd wear a hoodie that said overeater. You know, all all of it. <clears throat> Sorry, I didn't. Or all of it too. That's a good band name all too. Of it. I, I don't know if I brought water in here with me. Uh, let's see here. Just trying to grab some more numbers. Come on, man. That's Come on. Come band. on, man. Oh, that's I love that. When they're like, hey, give us a call. And then just, no number. No stupid number. Oh, I know. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about this today. It's 7-Eleven's uh, Bring Your Own Cup Day for slushies. I forgot all like, about this. Yeah, for, for real? Yeah, for a dollar ninety nine or two ninety nine, you bring your own cup, and it could be. They're they're doing restrictions now. They're like, because people used to bring in just like buckets. Now they're saying like they got to be able to fit <laughs> under the tray, uh, or under the yeah, to sit on the tray and they'd be able to pull that down to fill it. Like you can't just be like tilting no, it in. Yeah. To, yeah, people used to oh, abuse yeah. the shit out of that all the time. I forgot about that. That's they're uh, they're doing it at 7-Eleven, uh, Speedways, and I think there's one other place called Stripe or something like that. Hi. 7-Eleven? Yeah, I came in earlier and they, they wouldn't let me fill up my my uh, my device for the, the all you can, whatever the hell it is today, the Slurpee thing. Okay. And I, I just don't know what, no. I brought in, I, I brought in a football helmet from high school and they said that it wasn't acceptable. They wouldn't let me fill my football helmet up with slushy. 
Yeah, that's not something that they allow. Apparently they had changed the rules and corporate doesn't allow us to do that. So now there's a stand here and on the on the stand, have a good night. There's the terms and conditions of BYO Cup Day. Yeah. Um, and it tells you that it has to be a certain size and it's literally written on the display board because they had uh, issues with it a couple, uh, was it last year or the year before? Okay. Um, and a lot of that also has to do with like hygiene, you know, post-COVID situation. So that's probably... Those are probably some of the underlying reasons as to why they don't allow that. But if you bring a cup, you know, uh, you know, find a, a really big size yeah. cup or something. Well, yeah, that, that was the other thing. My son, he used he used his baseball cup, and they turned they turned him away as well. Okay, I'm not sure. Was it this location? Which location? Yeah, no, it was this location, and she said that something because he pulled it out of his jock strap, and that's where she had the problem. Well, yeah, it's a hygiene thing. Like I said, it's a post-COVID situation, so I'm sorry. Like, times are not as they used to be where, you know, people can just kind of do however they want. Now hygiene is, like, a big factor into that. And we just don't want people, like, uh, you know, getting sick or germs or, you know, all of that. So we just have to be mindful of that. I'm sorry. I, well, yeah, I just think the guy was jealous because my son had a – he has a big cup. He's got a big root on him, so he's got a big cup. Mm, I see. Okay. And I had a piss jar. I had a piss jar I could have used too, but no. They're not able to fill it, um, but maybe you can try it at another location. I mean, I could have filled it. You just wouldn't let me. <laughs> Sounds like where she wanted to come back and argue again. The kid's got a big root on him. What are you, you going to do? All right. We've got big balls. She's got big balls. And we've got the Thank biggest. Thank you for calling our telephone. Oh, the Oops, sorry. I put that in wrong. Conference number was not recognized. Please re-enter your conference you. number. If you are the moderator, please press 1. Otherwise, please hold to be placed into the conference. There are currently 44 other participants in the conference. Parents, my, my parents were wonderful people in many ways. I don't want to like be critical of them because I miss them terribly. They're both deceased now, and they were in many, many ways wonderful parents. Like I said, always very supportive of anything I wanted to do in my life. You know, I never doubted their love for me. Um, I, they provided access denied. Is um, never wanted for any. Sorry, that conference number was not recognized. Please re-enter your conference number, followed by the pound sign. Who's playing what in the background here? If you are the moderator, please press 1. Otherwise, please hold to be placed into the conference. There are currently 44 other participants in the conference. Pretty, pretty, you know, uh, intense. And, um... Young age. You are now unmuted. Little background. My so my father was a chronic compulsive eater, <clears throat> and um, he suffered with chronic compulsive eating his entire life. He never found any recovery. You know what I hear? There's a little noise on the line. Uh, that's really weird because I know the line was muted. It's fine. Yeah. Okay. Um, oh, that person's back again. Okay. Um, anyway, uh, I don't mean to, I don't mean to, I don't mean to interrupt, but this is Gail and I'm doing dash. So I'll take care of it. Oh, okay, Gail. Okay, great. I'm, I'm looking at the dash also. So thanks. Thanks for letting me know. Okay. So, uh, anyway, um, <clears throat> So, my father was a chronic compulsive eater, and, you know, through my childhood, I watched him, you know, try to get some control over his eating, and he, ha my father came from a family where he had two sisters that were very, very large women, and my grandmother and my grandmother's sister also really struggled with their weight, um, so there was a lot of anxiety and fear uh, in my family around um, the issue of weight and, um, and eating. But on the other hand, food was also used as, you know, the great 
panacea for everything. I mean, you know, if you didn't feel good, the message was eat something, you know, you'll feel better. So, you know, on one hand, there was this message like the holy grail was to be thin and to not want to eat. And on the other hand, food was, you know, was a way of like celebrate. It was used to celebrate. It was used to, uh, you know, to make you feel better if you were sick. It made you, it was used to make you feel better if you were feeling depressed or down or sad or whatever, you know. So, uh, you know, there was really like no way to win. Uh, it was, it was pretty much an impossible situation. And um, so anyway, as a child, I mean, my earliest memories of like relying on food, I guess, is that, you know, we're like coming home from school and just, you know, I had some anxiety about, uh, particularly about um, the, the bus ride home from school. Um, and uh, I just remember, You just about like, said the butt know, ride. Really wanting to get home from school so that I could eat, you know, that that would make me feel... Access denied. So like later it became... Like, Access denied. As soon as I got home, that was the first thing I wanted to do. Was Please press 1 to mute or unmute yourself. 4 or you are now unmuted. ...of the day. Um, and that became like a lifelong pattern for me um, of, um, of, I'm sorry, the background noise is sometimes distracting, um, of using food. My sorry, I, for, I forgot the mute, my sorry. Um, and, and kind of Access denied. Self-regulated. Please press 1 to mute or unmute you are old enough to when I got my first uh, you have been picked from this conference thank you oh boy they just got pee peed all over her, her thing all over her thing she was trying to share and you monsters made me call and, and pee all over that I, pee, I peed all over it my god disgusting <laughs> they're horrible human beings Okay. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> ah, thank you. You're so kind. I love your kind words. Who, who is what? Oh, the person I talked to? Or the one that was doing yeah. Oh, that was the Overeaters over Anonymous line. <laughs> so she was sharing her struggles and then... <laughs> and then I was like, oh, we we're peeing, we're peeing right over her story. All right, let's see. I don't even know, bro. Trying to find something cool. Uh, oop, I think I fat fingered that one. That's my nickname in college too, Fat Finger. Ah, good times at DeVry University. play eating chip sounds i was going to try to find some chewing sounds on the fly but i think that would drive me just as nuts ring 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 eat my ass do, 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 do. let's look at movie night real quick see where we're at on that If I find the right window, uh, it appears that there's a two-way tie with American Psycho 2, All-American Girl, and Ernest Goes to Jail. Those are tied. That's why. Bobby, if you please. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, that one guy in the movie, he looks a lot like Ernest. It's crazy. This man is a coiled cobra ready to strike at the slightest irregularity. <laughs> Ernest goes to jail should win, says uh, Icarus. I agree. 
Curtis P. Borrell. Prisoner. Oh, no, we already watched them. They're supposed to jail. True, true. I don't know what trap house is. I apparently put it on the list. Oh, that's the... Uh, you go and do drugs and then get trapped. Well, yeah, I know what a trap house is, but I wouldn't assume I would put a drug movie on there. That's not my style. Mm. Too many rings. Although, yeah, well, I guess Scarface really isn't a drug movie. It's just complimented. That's just good old stuff. wholesome classic movies. That That's the American yeah. dream right there. That's what that <laughs> is. That's, that's the one you do. That's the one that you should be inspired. You come to this country, I make something of yourself. You may die in a hail of bullets, but you know, at least at least you had some shit. That's true. At least for a in while, country, you are the king of the world. First you get the money. Then you get the power. Then you get the win. This is true. God, I don't know why I'm so tired. My eyes are literally burning. I'm trying to trying to look. Hi, can I uh, possibly make an order? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Uh, can I get the M18, the chicken tikka masala? Mild, medium, spicy. Spicy. You want to add rice with that? No rice, cause I'm a I'm a fat motherfucker with irritable bowel syndrome, and it'll just blow my asshole out. Hello. Yeah. Hi. No. No rice, please. Thank you. Okay. Uh, then can I get the, uh, the do you have the uh, sev puri? Yeah, we have it. Okay, I'll take that. One sev puri. Yep. Okay. And then uh, for for my buddy uh, Sanjay, he he asked if I could order him some gandu sala. Which one? Gandu sala. We don't have it. Okay, I thought he said it was some type of salad. Anything and, else? And he said if you didn't have that, to get him some uh, some behen sala. Anything else? Yeah, teri maki curry. Sorry. Teri maki curry. We don't have it. Okay. Do you have marachod? No. Okay. I guess just go ahead and hand the phone to your mother and I'll talk to her. Sorry? Do you have any rundi juice? No. Okay, all right. No rundi juice. Uh, do you have any gao mutra? No. Are you located on GB Road? Is this that location? No. Okay, all right. Well, I guess I have nothing else for you, motherfucker, you. Anything else? I guess not, unless you have a lovely sister. No. I want to see, I want to see her belly button. I want to see where the umbilical cord touched. Anything else? Do you have ugly sister? No. You have sister, sister? No. Do you do you have handicap sister? No. Do you have step sister? No. Do you have brother? Yeah. Okay. How old is brother? Why you want that? Because I want to know. <laughs> okay. So, so the brother was the sore point for him. He draws the line at at, at, at gay. I, I, I was um, gonna go straight for the. I was gonna ask for father, and then I was gonna be like, "Oh, we know you don't have a father," <laughs> but uh, he didn't let me get that far. He was gonna say like twelve or something. Hey, you know, he's, there he is, thousand father. Yeah. <laughs> he's got thousand. He's got the thousand fathers. Just one big milkshake from thousand father. Let's see. Um, 
Uh, a lot of these places are closed. Let's check again. Refresh. Closes in 38 minutes. I could work with this. Maybe. Maybe I can. Maybe I can't. Maybe I can or maybe I can't. Can't is more likely. You can't? You stupid fucking what? cunt. You idiot. You idiot. Idiot. Please, Bistro. Hi, I'd like to make an order, please. What can I get for you, sir? I gotta have some Kung Pao chicken. We gotta have the Kung Pao chicken? Yeah. White rice, okay? What, are you saying that because I'm white? No. <laughs> Maybe I like brown rice. You can get brown rice. I got the button right here. Okay. Just tell me whichever one you like. Okay, wait a minute. Which one do you like? I like white rice, ah, but uh, that but that's because uh, um, yeah. well the fried rice here is actually good because uh, they make it with the soy sauce right. and not you know like the 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 yellow dye. So I actually would recommend the fried rice. The fried rice. All right, I'll take some fried rice. I mean, fried rice has done some terrible things to me after the fact. You know about how, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, but maybe we need to do the white rice. I don't I don't know what would please you more. I I like to I like to please. Tell me what to order. Let's do the white rice. Okay, we'll it'll do white go rice. Great, it'll go great with that sauce. Okay. And I was looking. Um, uh, you got the you got the mapo tof, tofu, right? We do. Don't give me that shit, okay? We ain't gonna give you. That. I I don't want I don't want none of that because I'm a I'm a no, I'm no. a meat I'm a meat eater. <laughs> we ain't gonna give you no tofu. Okay, listen. So I got a friend. He's he's a uh, he's a vegetarian. And I'm gonna I'm gonna tell him like, can you mark on the receipt that this is tofu, and then just give me the the, the chicken Thai noodles, and I'm gonna make him eat I'm gonna make him eat chicken. <laughs> give you the chicken Thai noodles and yeah. tell him it's veggies. Yeah, yeah. Uh, give me the chicken Thai noodles and and say mm -hmm. uh, on the receipt that it's the tofu. <laughs> okay. This guy, he's been every every day. He keeps asking. He goes, he goes, "Hey, is your sister still married?" Every time I see him, and I'm like, "Dude, oh, I was like, they've yeah. been together for 15 years. Yeah, they're still together." So, so now the next time he, I'm gonna be like, "Hey, man, some leftovers in the fridge. Some of that tofu stuff. It was really good. Tastes just like regular meat." And then he's gonna go and he's gonna he's gonna eat it. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna tell I'm gonna say, "Leave my fucking sister alone." <laughs> I'll, I'll ride on their veggie. <laughs> oh, sweet, sweet. You're the you're the best. You're the best. Listen, did you you guys don't do buffets or anything, do you? Mm -mm, not us. Who who does? I'm not sure. I just got here from Alabama a week ago, so I haven't even. Explored oh, from Alabama? Yet. What you what you doing down there? My uh, I work. Me and my hubby work Chinese food. Oh, okay. And I and, I, and uh, my friend knows the owner, and he told me that they're good. Fat, you know, they're good people here. So I've never quite heard. I've never heard, I've never heard of that. So that uh, yeah, I've never quite heard of that. Uh, that that career move to move states for uh, to do the Chinese. Oh, but, I do. I've gone. I've gone to California, Texas, Louisiana, Alabama. All right, who's got the best Chinese? Who's got the best Chinese then out of all those states? Hmm. I'm asking. So I'm me. asking for big BBW Layla. She wants to know. If it's more authentic Chinese food, I would say California. Right. But regular Chinese food is a tie so far between this one and Alabama. No, this one in Louisiana. They do good Chinese in Louisiana. Mm-hmm. Like what's diff What's as, different as, about as it? As long as long as you go to the small, as long as you go to the small owners, because they're still from the same province in China, so you're still getting the same type. Oh, do, do they uh, cook? I, I, you probably can't tell me this. Do they cook cook with that gutter oil from over in China? Do they send that over here to cook with? No, no, not over here. A oh. lot, a lot. I've heard, I've heard about it. But over here, like when I go in the back of the kitchen, they can't. They don't do none of that here. All of our stuff is sealed. 
Okay, did they do that on the I'm, walks? I'm real, I'm, I'm real suspicious about food. Yeah, on the walks and stuff. Do they do they uh, do they treat those? Do they do the seasoning on the walks and stuff beforehand? Or, oh, okay. Mm-hmm. I watched I, one do. guy. I I asked him. I said, Hey, can I watch you cook there? I was like, I got bad I got bad uh, allergies, and I walked back there, and he he had a rusty walk, and I'm pretty sure some of it was ch- was chipping off in my food, and and that's oh, how and that's didn't do that. yeah, that's how my son was born. He was born with a helmet on, basically. <laughs> oh, our, here they they treat theirs yeah. every practically every other day because they use them so much. Yeah. Hey, uh, how so- let me ask you, how solid is that marriage? Mine. Yeah. Seven years this year. Ah, so it's on the rocks. No. Oh, well, me and I- him, me and him going to Mexico in about four months. And that's when you're getting rid of him? What are you going to do? Are you going to rip up his passport? <laughs> no. He has, we, we, we've known each other for 10, but we've been married for seven. Our water business and house is in, is in Mexico, so we, we go back and forth between, between America and Mexico. Like, I work in, we work in America. Wait, wait, wait a minute. But is our your, property is down there. Is your, you know is, what I'm saying? Is your husband a bald man? Nope. Okay, I, th- I could have swore this. He, he, I could have swore this was Sophia. Yeah, I could have swore this was Sophia, and you were talking about John. My husband, his name's uh, Jose. Jose. He's, he, mm, he still got a head full of hair, so, and he's a short. Wait, 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 okay, he's wait, only like wait, wait, two inches taller than me. Where did you meet him? This sounds like some ninety-day fiance him. shit going on right now. I no, I met him at work. Because I, I went to work at the Chinese restaurant in Mobile, mm-hmm. and he was the cook there, and we just hit it off, and we were friends for about two years, and best friends, and we got married, and we've been together ever since. Well, all right, this I is, don't, I, I don't, I don't even believe this story now. You're married and I, you're best I, friends. I, I don't want to hear that. I, now you're making I, stuff I, up. I swear to you. Oh. Now he's he's my only one. Until when? Is so, our, is my is actually my first time being away. How long how long have you been away? Only a week. So it, a it's week. like it's like the hardest part because it is the first time. Usually I work the restaurant with them, right? Mm-hmm. But the one in in Mobile is already full up, so I, so that's why I came over here because I I we usually work the same restaurant. Mm-hmm. You know, I work up front and he cooks. Are you like into stuff? And what stuff? Like stuff. What kind of stuff? It's like the, I mean, I don't want to say it over a recorded line, just, you know, stuff. Mm, don't think so. Like, like paranormal drug use? No, no, nothing like that. See, I don't physically smoke it. I actually, I've been known to uh, use a Ouija board and summon ghosts that were like in cartels and stuff. And they smoke, they smoke marijuana and different drugs. And then they well, blow, they, they blow yeah, it, in, they, they yeah, blow they it in my them. face. That's how they manifest. They blow their drugs in my face, and then I get paranormal drug use high. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> nothing like that. Cause they squarer than me. I, I, I don't even think he's drinks. What is he? he st- is he, he, he straight nothing. edge? Okay, he's nothing. straight edge. He is. Oh, that's boring. Like who's even, supposed to go to strip I've, clubs with even you? Even I've smoked green, okay, but, but him never nothing zero. You Only just work. admitted to drug use? Oh my god! Never. Does your husband know? I would how, never. How many times have you injected marijuana? Zero. <laughs> You've never you never melted it down and injected just straight THC right to the bloods. <laughs> no. no? I so, work Chinese food. I don't have time to do nothing but work and go home. That is it. Yeah, but on your way home, you've got some downtime, don't you? No, I don't. Oh, shit. So so tell me about your mother. What, what's that relationship like? Passed on. Always. Passed on? What, mm-hmm. So why'd you but, do it? But, like, my, my family's passed on already. Like, my mom, my what? parents, all that. Yep. Because they's my only family. This sounds like a Dateline NBC story about the fire off. Why'd you do it? Why'd I do what? Get you, married? No. 
Why is everybody gone and you're the only one left? What'd you do? I didn't do nothing. They're, that's what happens with family stuff. They're, they're just gone. You know, my mom and Did they my ever dad find them? passed away. They, they're passed away in heaven. They are gone. Well, yeah, I'm sure that they've already, they've determined that they're like, after so many years, like they're just declared, they're just gone. They're declared gone. It's okay. You can tell me like, listen, I, I won't, I'm a steel trap. I won't say nothing. I'm not a cop. I'm not a cop. I'm not a cop. If that helps. I'm not a cop. No, I, my, my family's really passed away. I have no family. Because if, if I was a cop, I'd have to tell you. <laughs> That's not true. That's not Cops lie all the time. Wait a minute, are you a cop? Of course. I, well, I might be working shade, working the Chinese food on the side. That sounds like some weird shit going on. I'm kind of scared. I'm low key scared. Like no cap. <laughs> Dude, I'm probably the most boring person you've ever met in your life. All I do is go to work, talk to my husband when I get off, and that is my life. Oh, you riz your husband when you get home? My husband's in Alabama. Yeah, well, you riz him. You get on the phone and you throw some riz at him. No cap. Okay, on a real though, can I just make an order for, uh, can I get one gallon of soy sauce? We do not sell soy sauce. In you the got country. soy sauce back there. Come on. I can give you extra soy sauce. How many packets of soy sauce can I get? As many as you want. Oh, that's what I like. That's how you keep your man around, don't you? You're like, oh, you can going to have as much as you want. How many cats do you own? I own no cats. How many pets? What pets do you have? I own no pets. I feel if you came from Alabama, you would you would own a gator. What? Like an, a like an alligator. Gators in Alabama. Well, uh -huh. you just go to the swamp. You're like, mm -hmm, come here. Well, you were in Louisiana, too. I mean, they got gators. The one guy, uh, I watched uh, the one the the show on Discovery. They hunt alligators. I forget the name of the show, but the one guy he he talked like he had mud in his mouth, and you couldn't really understand him. But he could shoot a gator. <laughs> Deadliest cat? Oh no, that was crabs. I forget. That's crabs. So like, right. I'm gonna send you a cat. A cat? Why would I need a cat? Because I don't need this one anymore. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. It's a gifted cat. You can't look a gift cat, a gift cat in the mouth. Come on. I can. No, I cannot have any pets. Okay, come on. I'm gonna drop him. I'm gonna put him on a leash and put him out at the front door when I come to get my order. And you just take him home. No, no way, no way, no way. It's okay. We can't have animals. You want to? You want to hear what, it? What, what, want, am gonna, what am I gonna do? With he's that? a good. He's a good animal. He, hang on. Aww. Come here, kitty. Say hello. Say hello. That, that's why. That's why he's gonna stay with you because he's a good. Oh cat. no, he likes you. Listen to him. Listen. No. He sound. Me. <laughs> he he liked you. I gotta, I gotta go place your order now. No, no, hang on. Oh, see, see, kitty cat likes you, likes you good. Oh, really good, really good. Where are you going? I'm not hanging out for her to come back. She goes to place that order, that's bullshit. Eh? That whole conversation, and she's like, ah, I'm still going to go place that order. Uh, what's up, Leon? Mother, motherfucker, you. I don't know why it's showing this view on this stupid player. It's different now. It's different. I don't like different. I'll blow, blow the doors right off this fucking hinges. She was, she was fun to talk to, but... I don't know if I believe the story that she's just traveling across the country making bank, living in different countries and shit. She's got a house in Mexico from fucking touring across America, taking Chinese food orders. If that if that's true, I'm gonna run into traffic in about three minutes. I'm just right out in the traffic.
Uh, let's see. Let's see. Um, shit, what is it? Oh. oh, oh, yeah, let's do it. What, uh, Leon Garcia? What's up, mother, mother, motherfucker, you? Leon Johnson. That's what I about called him. I about to call him a motherfucker, too. Send her off with a cat. Yeah, she did. I. She said she talks to her husband after they get off work. She talked an awful lot. I think she hasn't been talking to anybody and really had to spill all that out. Like how I assumed after they've been together for seven years of marriage, like, ah, so it's on the rocks. <laughs> ah, it's on the way out. True believer in the institution. Wow, well, I've I've never been married. And my parents are divorced, and I I've t I know other people that are divorced, and they were like you know mother motherfucker to them, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so they're like this this mother this motherfucker here. I don't know what it is now, but it used to be a fifty fifty chance that you'll make it. I think it's still about the same. I don't think it's changed really. That's why it's when we end up watching 50 or 50, 90 day fiance. I'm just like, this is fucking ridiculous. Like they're like complaining about shit. You would find out on a third date. They're over there. Like, I don't think we're able to work through these problems. Really? Maybe, maybe you skip the fucking engagement and you go to like, hello, this is just Bubba Westwood. How may I help you? Hi, I need to uh, No, I, uh, the Bobas, can you do like orders on the phone or is it strictly online? I'm sorry, it's strictly online through like different apps or um, through Snack Pass. Okay, because I've never, I'm actually curious because I've never had a Boba before. And I, so, uh, what is it exactly? It's like Boba itself is like the topping and it's like made of tapioca flour. It's like chewy, like the chewy balls, I guess. We um, cook it in brown sugar, so it kind of tastes brown sugary. So like a like a sweet sweetness then. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and like so, how uh, there's so there it's like a, a liquid and there's balls inside of it then. No, um, like it's the boba itself is like solid, and then it's yeah. um, we mix it with tea, so it's oh. like a drink that has the topping inside of it. Okay, so how do you drink it then if there's stuff that like could can obstruct the straw? We have bigger straws that are um, large enough for toppings to go through. So I don't I don't get so you just drink drink you just suck through a straw? Yeah. Oh, but but I So you just suck it then. You just suck the balls in? Yeah, yeah. But but I ain't gay. You just have a larger straw. Yeah, okay then. But I ain't gay. I really don't give a shit. I but hey, I ain't gay. I don't suck balls. Come on. <laughs> Damn, it took a long oh, ways to God. get to get where we were going, but we got that, there. That was worth it, though. Yeah. Which, Destination you, was worth you, it. You got chewy balls in there, just so you guys know. It's got some just chewy ass balls. And I just I just want to put it out there that her description was false. The balls are not a topping. The balls go to the bottom of the drink. Oh yeah, they they They're definitely not do not go to the top. I've never had them, but I've I've been with someone <laughs> that. Uh, funny story. Went to uh, a, get a seafood boil at this place, and their their seafood boils are excellent. You sit down, and they brought us glasses of water because that's that's all we wanted. We just wanted water. So they bring the other person a fucking cup, and it had lipstick on the fucking glass on the rim. And I'm like, does this lady just bring her fucking break glass over here? Like, just job finish drinking out of this. Let's just put some water in. Take so, I don't know where she comes over and she brings us two bobas. And I'm like, well, I can't, you know, it's fucking tapioca and all this shit. I can't have this. And uh, so, yeah, they tried to. They were like, oh, it was, it was, it was pretty decent. But yeah, we got we got boba forced upon us. But uh, yeah, yeah, it's it's okay, it's okay, I guess, from how it's described. Apparently, balls just explode in your mouth. I think it's a choking hazard to be just drinking liquid and all of a sudden something solid just goes right into your fucking throat hole. I don't think that's very safe. 
Yeah, go. She had a girthy, a girthy straw. Such a big straw. Hello, time. Hi, you have boba, right? Yes. Ah, oh, good, good. Uh, what's the best type of boba? I've never had it before. Well, I have a lot of, I have a lot of uh, different bobas. Okay. And we have the twenty, the the uh, top twenty. I like I like strawberry. Does you have anything with yeah, strawberry? Yeah. yeah, we have a lot of different uh, drinks with the strawberry. You can go to the, you can go to online, and just look for both time, and they they have the menu online. You can see the menu online. I, I would like to do that, but I'm blind. Oh. I can't see. Yeah. Yeah, so I, yeah, we have a strawberry. I had to yell at my phone to dial, and it. I have I have a handicap phone, so when I don't speak clearly, it punches me in the eye. Oh, I see, I see. A very abusive yeah, but, phone. It's a T-Mobile. Oh, I see. Yeah, if you come to the store, we can help you better right here. But yeah. but I'm blind. How am I going to get to the store? I can't drive. Oh, I see. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. You know what? I'll give it a shot. I think I can drive. I think this is a car. All right, I'm going to get in the car. Hang on. Uh, What's the address? I'll draw, I'll start driving. Uh, 701 South Vermont. Okay, hang on. All right. Hey, no, no, don't go nowhere. Hang on. Just told a blind man to come get some boba. You're a jerk. Absolutely. He, hung up. he did hang up, yeah. Motherfucker hung up. He's a, he told me he told me to commanded me to drive. <laughs> you know, fucking fucking. <laughs> now he doesn't back. want to face the consequence. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's not his problem. All of a sudden, tell a blind man to start driving to come to the store. We could help you better. Can't try to get to the store, and all of a sudden, bullshit. Thought I saw something pop up on my phone. Uh oh, the the daily Reddit email. I gotta figure out how to shut that off. I don't, I don't care. If I want to see what's on Reddit, I'll go look. And that would pretty much never happen. I don't, I don't even do it. I don't even do it. <laughs> I just found another restaurant, and I've got something fucking devious about to be said. If I can get someone on the phone. Oh, my nose is stuffed up. Boba Fett would be awesome. Yeah, I bet the next time a lady answers, she's going to have a big... Big fat belly on her. Might be some wishful thinking. So call me help you. Yeah, hi. Uh, I was calling to uh, to get something to eat. Uh, the sweets. You got the sweets. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. What has the most sugar? The most sugar. You mean the dessert or drink? Uh, either or. Maybe even a combo. What's the the highest sugar content in a drink and the highest sugar content in a uh, dessert? Uh, for a drink. We can adjust the sugar on the drink. Like okay, sugar but I want sugar. extra. I want extra sugar. Yeah, all the drinks can put extra sugar. No problem. Okay, because I'm I'm uh, I'm actually working very late at night here at work, and and I'm next I'm next next in line for the big promotion, but I think Carl over in HR is gonna get it, so I want to take his diabetic ass some some sugar. <laughs> okay. So I need something real sugary. Yeah, I mean. For the, the for example the hold on one second okay I don't want I don't want to kill him I just want to put him in a diabetic coma for a bit so I can get the promotion okay, the, the they'll bring him out they'll br they'll bring him out afterwards after I'm promoted the coconut finds a lot of sugar ah yeah there we go <laughs> let me okay. get let me get three of those and then all the drink you can adjust the sugar yeah all right I like the way I like the way you think all right uh so I can do I can I order over the phone or I just come in and get it. Yeah. Uh -huh. Give me one second, okay? Okay. All right. You're not going to contribute anything else to the call. I'm not. I'm not wasting minutes. <laughs> as, as a fellow Venus, how dare you? I'm just listen. Listen. I'm just trying to get promoted. I'm just trying to live my best life. And and if you know, I'll tell Miss Stevia, and he's just going to be done. He's, he'll go into his little coma for a little bit. I'll get promoted. <laughs> then they'll, they'll bring him out. He's going to still be in the same position at work. Might get demoted for missing time, though. <laughs> Not sure how that works. 
Oh boy. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know why I saw the name of the company and I just started chuckling. I'm like, I've got an idea. <laughs> Gonna end up like a weekend at Bernie situation? Yeah, probably. That was Satan's wife. Oops. I don't know about that. Hello, Boba. Hi. I, I have to make a complaint about the stra the the strawberry peach boba I got. When you get it? I got it half an hour ago. It was my first it was my first time getting a boba, and. This uh, strawberry peach. The boba. Yeah, you know, but that's not strawberry peach. This is strawberry. Uh, I think uh, a strawberry coconut. Uh, oh, the, yeah, the strawberry coconut boba, yeah. It was my first time getting boba, and I think there was something, you guys did something, you didn't mix it very well. There was stuff in the bottom, and when I sucked it, like, something got caught in my throat, and I, I passed out, and I, and I pissed and shit myself. Something stuck inside the boba? Yeah, I, I sucked the tea, and there was something hard inside of it, and it went into my, into my meat hole, and I, I fell down and I hit my head on a on an Audi and I dented the Audi and then I shit and pissed myself. Oh, uh, who? You come over here. Who come over here? Who, who I, I did. I did. How many drinks? And Just one drink. Yeah, one drink. And then I drank. I drank. I guess the balls. The balls went into my stomach, and now I'm afraid that they're going to plug my pee hole, and I'm not going to be able to pee. How do I pee after drinking boba? How? Tell me. What, what's the pee? Yeah, make urine. How do I make urine after drinking boba? Because there were balls inside of it, and it's going to plug my pee hole, my urethral hole. Yeah, I don't know about I'm going to have to shrink a, magi a magical little school bus and swallow it so it could go inside and blast the boba with a laser. I, I don't know, you know, the, we just made boba so far. So can you come over here? So can I make another one for you? Yeah, I want to come over and I'm going to show, I'm gonna show okay, you okay. my plugged up pee pee hole. Yeah, sorry for that. Okay, come over here. Thank you. You don't understand. <laughs> Damn. Damn, damn, damn. A rational fear, in my opinion. <laughs> you clog your <you> urethra. <laughs> well, hey, you watch King of the Hill so much, and fucking Hank Hill. You have your paranoia <laughs> to that narrow urethra hole. Or you talk to Cat. Cat, who fucking admitted to getting chopsticks and playing with her husband's fucking foreskin and making his penis dog go, me, 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 me. Making the little mouth make noise. The little penis mouth. Don't even try to deny that shit, Cat. Right. Yeah, Cat's peeing right now. She's not gonna deny it, cause she she knows she did it. She she did that shit. Oh my god. Uh huh. She used to say, "Oh, when Carlito used to say that about the me me me, like making the penis talk." She was like, "Oh, Carly, I thought I was the only one that did that." And, and yeah, gross. She's she's a gr <laughs> she's a gross woman. Not here to defend herself. I I don't know why she, she couldn't defend herself even if she tried because she knows it's fucking true. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not making this shit up. That's a that's a legit conversation that was had. My goodness, she's she's a disgusting boba. woman. How about that boba? <laughs> we get some more of that boba, boba boba, boba boba. I got boba the other day and. There was a kid who was being bad, and the parents said, fine, no boba. And the kid, like, made this longing look at the counter and was like, boba. <laughs> like, I had somebody show me today, uh, <laughs> th this one kid, this child that was, like, sitting there, like, the, the parent was like, you want to try wasabi? And the kid's like, wasabi. 
What's that like whining for uh-huh. it? And then the parent was like, okay, smell it first. And then put just a little bit. I mean, it was just like a fucking toddler. And put a little bit in the mouth. And the kid is like sat there in a second later and looks at the camera. And was like, help. <laughs> the kid was like, oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ask, ask for some horse machine radish. Yeah. Hey, K-pop addict. Uh, oh, thank nope. you. I, mean, I appreciate that. Bubba Bubba Northridge, how may I help you? Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm on a lot of illicit drugs right now, and I, I'm going to branch out and try some boba for the first time. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry for you. Um, uh, what's the best type of boba? Um, like the best drink? Yeah. Um, probably be our Bobo King or our Dragon Flare. What? What's a Dragon Flare? It's I've, just like a lychee. Fl- I know about Dragon <laughs> Mirror, but not not that one. Uh, it's just a lychee flesh with mango and dragon fruit puree. Yeah. Mhm. Like, the, is it pretty looking? Yeah, it is. Does it make you trip any longer? No, <laughs> unfortunately, no. Ah, I'm, I'm trying to find something to extend the. Uh, you know the trip, uh-huh. the trip as it is. Yeah, no, I get you. <laughs> I've 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 been soaking a lot of marijuana in in different teas and drinking it. I think this one's gonna uh-huh. be a winner. Oh okay. <laughs> My Ouija board just told me to get extra boba balls. Oh okay. So how many boba balls come in one? Um, not a lot. I, I'm running low on mescaline too. Hello? Oh, I'm starting to go to a different universe. Ah, motherfucker, more boba. More fucking boba, motherfucker. Okay. Bye. See you later. <laughs> you don't get the boba. Get, get upset. Boba. Boba. Uh, just a quick check in on uh, movies. Boba. Ernest Goes to Jail has pulled ahead uh, four votes to a couple of different two votes, but it's it's got a two vote lead. Can I get double, double balls? Double boba balls? I don't know. I don't fucking run the place. There's a lot of places in, cost a little bit more. <laughs> there's a lot of places to do boba. Yeah, no shit. It's like it's like a drug almost, man. It's like almost it's like, like McDonald's. It's, it's like almost like on every fucking street. I like the one by me lets you pick how much sugar to put in. You can tell them to to drop it down to twenty five percent. And it's still really sweet at twenty five percent sweet. So tell them say. Hey, motherfucker, no sugar. See what they do now. Hello, baby. How may I help you? Hi. Hi. Can I get Hazel Eyes inspired boba? Yeah, regular or large. I want it. I want large and I want some Hennessy put in it. Um, we can't do that. But if I bring my own bottle of Hennessy, is it cool? Uh, no, sorry, we can't. Outside? Like, if I go outside and pour it in? Um, yeah, we could just make the drink and you just pour the alcohol in yourself. But yeah, we can't do it and, then, and then I come back inside and I drink it inside. Um, yeah, that's fine. And then I'm going to get drunk and, bel- and belligerent and I'm going to suck the balls right out of the boba. Um. You know Boba Fett? That was my nickname in high school. That's I was the boba was named after me. Okay. Okay. Like, are we are we in agreement then? I'm only oh, I'm, I'm only I'm only 19, and you told me it was cool if I put the booze in and drink it myself under premises. I'm sorry. Give me one second. <laughs> Why? Um. Give me one second. I. Is this how you become an alcoholic? When you start putting Hennessy and everything? Because I want to go on that trip.
Um, I'm sorry, we can't do that. Uh, hello? Hi. Are, yeah. I, oh, I, I couldn't hear you there for a second. Uh, it sounded like there, were, there was a lot of noise in the background. Come on, you. Come on. Come on. You go. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, That's what you get for yeah. going on speakerphone, bitch. <laughs> That's what you get for trying to put my shit out in the streets. You get <laughs> you get gay sex sounds on speakerphone in a business. That's what you get. Get some Bailey's Irish boba. <laughs> we we were having a nice conversation back and forth, and then she got to go and involve other people in our shit. Uh, let's see here. Some BSO. Uh, yeah. Joan, Jones 9691. Yes, I see it. <laughs> right. Bring, bring your own shit. Uh, I don't know. That's a lot of reading. Bonk, bonk heck. That's a lot of reading. You typed, you typed a paragraph. I don't know where you mistook me for a fucking reader. I can't read. I don't do that shit. Reading's for nerds, so don't read your email or social media. School for kids who can't read really, really good. What is this? <laughs> Needs to be at least three <laughs> times the size. How are the kids supposed to learn how to Ooh, read if they can't yeah. even fit inside of the school? Good point. It's true. Don't watch the second Zoolander t terrible movie. <laughs> don't watch that one. Terrible. Uh, let's see here. I feel colored due to the fact that I've seen Ernest film in British, but got reference from The Simpsons. Wasted on boot. What the fuck are you even talking about? This is what I get for reading the chat. Start reading the chat. Get lost in conversation. See, nothing good comes from reading. <laughs> Dwight, my girlfriend's a short-legged, happy Puerto Rican. Help. Uh, as long as she's not taking nasty curry shits. Hello, the Corona. Hi. Yes, yeah, can I, I have you? Yeah, I have a complaint, if you have the time, my good sir. Yes. I came in and got a Boston cream pie donut, uh, and then I got an order of the, sh the cinnamon sugar twists, and then the devil's okay. food chocolate donut, and, okay. and, your, and your stuff made me fat. And now my wife doesn't love me. <laughs> That's a true story. She's divorcing me because I can't stop eating your shit. Okay. And so, something else? Yeah, so now I'm coming in and I'm going to marry your wife. Motherfucker, you. And something else? And then... Come on. And then... And then 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 I don't know why all of a sudden it's, it's showing me like four, four places, four, four. Why? Why is there four? Well, they could have, they could have four beds. Maybe. Maybe. Turn that back on. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then... Zoltan! No Zoltan, no. There's a smear of something on my chest. No, there's not. That's incorrect. That's false information. Oh no, Ernest, Ernest uh, goes to jail has increased its lead. 
You're on ketamine? You K-hold yourself? Tony Service. Hey, hello? Yes, I'm gonna I, help you. I need to uh, know where you took my car. What kind of car are you looking for? Is a uh, Hyundai Civic. It's blue. Honda Civic blue? Hey. Where was it though from? A uh, 7-Eleven. Uh, they say a problem because I park on the little blue cripple boy. Let me check you a second. Okay. Okay, from what address was it too? Is is the seven eleven? I they went uh I mean look look uh, Roscoe Boulevard North Ridge one eight four six one They say I park on little blue cripple boy. When was it though? Yeah, I was 15, 20 minutes ago. I was inside, you bathroom come out, I gone. I asked the guy, uh, I see, I see, hey, where the where my car go? The car right there. He said, you, you guys are took. Who did he call? I don't know. He said, you took. He said, hey, uh, when we could to throw something, we call these guys, they come. So that he said, you just come, you come and you take. What was that again, sir? They say you come and you did a take. They say no car. They say you come, you take, and you go. And they say sign on car. And they wrote on the, they say, say, call this number. Motherfucker. He say motherfucker to me. He didn't call a company. I could tell you that much. No, he say you took, you took, you take. So like, how do I get the, my car back? Russ, you want to receive it, correct? Uh, uh, yes, I think, yes. Yes. And they say you took yeah. 15, 20 minutes. I got to have my car back. I got to. You don't I, have it, sir. I came in to get more beer because you can't drive. You can't drive very good without beer. I tried to get some Four Locos and some Modelos. We don't have it, sir. Listen, I can't drink and drive without the car. Like, motherfucker, you. Okay. Well, I we need, don't have your car. I need my car back, please. Come on, guy. Come on. We don't have your car. Why? What happened? Where it go? Where it go? I don't know. But I don't understand. I don't. I don't, I don't understand. Well, ask him. What company did he call? He told me day. He said day, day, night, day and night of towing. Okay, we don't have it. Well, where to go? Listen, listen, listen. If you're not going to tell me, I'm just going to yell at you. <laughs> How are your ears now? I yell at you. Now, where is my car, please? Please. I'm going to stand in traffic until... Until you give me my car back. Fuck you! You have a car! I don't have a car. This guy has my car. I'll stand here all night on you. You know, I don't have to pay attention to nothing. You can do whatever the way you want, asshole. I don't know how long ago he disappeared, but he did. Hey, hey, is Kat back? Is she still not defending herself about the making Mads Mimi hole talk and shit? She must be taking a long shit.
No, sorry, I had stepped away, but what? <laughs> yeah, no, we were talking about you fondling Mad's foreskin with a, with chopsticks and then making his Mimi hole top. Chopsticks? Yeah. No, that, that's not part of it. That, yeah, yeah, huh? You said you unfolded uh-huh. his foreskin with, <laughs> with <laughs> chopsticks. <laughs> yeah, you make it talk. <laughs> it, right, 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 yeah. Me, 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 me. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Is like Carlito did that, and you were like, "Oh, I thought I was the only one that made that happen." I was like, "Yes, yeah, somebody else does that." <laughs> Except Carlito was doing it as a joke, and Cat's like, "Ah, oh, for real, for real, on, <laughs> on the real." I have the power. I guess that's what you want to call. Is that how you free the boba when it gets stuck in the mimi hole? <laughs> You're talking about having it be a choking hazard. Yeah, no, we we're talking about getting it stuck in your fucking urethra so you couldn't piss. Like, it gets stuck. It gets stuck in there. Oh, no. What do we oh, do? That's good, though. That's good stuff. Cat, quit trying to convert people, okay? Nobody's okay. going to convert to your <laughs> Californian ways. Jesus. Everybody out oh, here, I'll just do what California. That, that's why we're stuck every time we fucking call someone California consumers. Every fucking place. Uh, I'm trying to find more addresses. What is? I saw my twelve oh eight. Jesus Christ! <laughs> we're, call a tow truck company. Tell them we're gonna tow their tow truck, so that they quit trying to compete with us. Yeah. Oops, I did it again. Sorry, I'm getting a little loopy now. It's I've been up for a bit. And then I cut my finger putting the grill together and blood drained from my body. I might turn into a half man, half grill. How can I help you? Hello? Yes, how can I help you? I have a problem in, in my room. Uh, what's the room number? Where do I find that? Because I've been, I've been drinking and I don't remember what room number I'm in. Um, I need the room number. Like, where do I find that? Uh, outside of your room? Uh, or on your phone? On my phone? No, this is my cell phone. Uh, no, on the, on the motor's phone. Uh, I, but I have a problem, like, I, I, I was, cause I had messed my trousers, that's a whole different story. But I had taken the bed sheets and wrapped myself in them. And I went into the bathroom to clean myself up. And I just, I, I just, like, fell backwards and hit the plunger thing on the toilet to flush it. And sucked the sheets in the toilet. And now it's stuck in the toilet. Um, um and, let, let me know the number. I will, I will talk to the manager. Okay. See, uh, like, see, like, I come, I, co- I come back in here. No, the sheet's stuck. But if I flush it, see, I flush it, and now the water comes up instead of going down, and the water comes out. See, it's stuck, and now water is on the floor. Um, let me know the number. I will come to the room. Why, where do I find it? On the phone. On uh, which phone, the one out by the bed? Yes. All right, I'm gonna try to get out there. It is, it is very slippery in here. Give me a second here. Uh, step over the, oh! oh. Oh, my fucking balance. the phone is it still on hello Where's yes the... what's your what's your name what? my last name is Johnson 
Okay, I'll come to the room. I got Boba B. Tuna inside of me. Apparently, we got a short voicemail to play. Here we go. This is Byron. Hello, did you call earlier? Hello? Hello? Point to this. Did you call earlier? How should I know? Okay. Bye. I don't even know who you are. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. He's mocking her. What? You didn't tell me why you were concerned. Oh, she hung up. I do like she was like, oh, okay. And then he offered it. Oh, okay. Right back at her. Yep. Bum Bumblebee tuna tea. Yeah, that synced up so well. So yeah, it cool. really did. Yeah, yeah. It was right on there. Right on the tit, as people would say. Is that what people say? Everyone from New York is a cunt? Boy, I, there's probably some people at the, the... At the New Yorks that might have an objection to that. Boba Cola, you're the one. I want to go to sleep. Da -da -da. Uh, movie night voting. There's like 16 more minutes. Any pets? Uh, sorry. Thank you for calling the Best Western Plus Carriage. And you're speaking with Troy. How may I help you? Hey, Troy. Um, I got people complaining about apparently me having my pet here. I don't know what's going on. Um, what's your room number? Uh, I'm at 215. Easy, easy, easy. I'm going to get you something to eat. i got to talk to the man. Um, so people are, I don't know, the person next door came over and, and I mean, they weren't banging on my door, but they were knocking. And I'm, and I'm trying to keep my cat as quiet as I can. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, uh, what did you say your number was one more time? 215. Okay. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay. Um. Uh, Two fifteen. Yeah. Um, sir, we don't have a two fifteen at our hotel. Uh, no, I believe that's the room I'm in. I don't know. Uh, uh, if you could go and check, please. Uh, what's your last name so that I can confirm the reservation? My last name is Johnson. All right. I'm, I'm just right here at the top of the stairs. Give me a second here. Let me go look. Uh, let's see here. Cause I was down. I was down at the gym earlier. That that's a that's nice. I was glad to, that was there. Uh, right. I had I had lunch over at Denny's too. That's good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Why it's supposed to be on the phone? I would assume, right? Uh, did, so I, I I have it here that you called from not an in-house phone. Oh yeah, no, this is my uh, cell. Call... That's my cell phone. Yeah, when, when you call from your cell, that goes to our exterior phone line, and thus, you know, I, I can't see it through, you know, I can't see a room number through it. Oh, um, okay. Uh, yeah, yep. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to figure it, figure it out. I'm just, because mm -hmm. I'm, I'm down here, I'm down here to go to the theme parks and stuff like that, you know, and I, I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm like, yeah, theme parks and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Let's see here. Still looking. You didn't you didn't find my reservation? Uh nope. Um uh you know, I have got uh no nope. I, I don't have anyone named Johnson or anywhere near anything on the second floor. Um uh, any chance it could be under someone else's name? Uh, no, I mean it should be under my name. I used my credit card and, and everything and like okay. so yeah, it should it should it should definitely be me. Okay. Uh, if you could just check your room number, please. 
Um, it should just, you know, a little sign outside the door. Uh, to, uh, two, uh, to 225? Okay. Uh, let me take a look. <laughs> that is quite a loud kitty. <laughs> it's a bobcat. Ah! Okay. Wow. Wow. I I caught don't, it. Don't I, hear about those being pets. Well, well, I I caught this often. one. I'm trying to domesticate it. I caught it about three days back. Hmm. Okay. Um. Uh, is there anyone else in the room with you? Uh. Well, my my uh. Well, fiance. She was. She's here, but she's not in the room with me right now. Uh, but okay. yeah. Uh, could I get her last name? I'm I'm looking at 225, and it's not matching your name. I'm, you know, maybe you know, d does it match your wife's name? Uh, what's your wife's name? Car the last name is Carlson. Unfortunately, it, it's not that either. Um, because I I had what, talked uh, what, I had talked to uh, Joel uh, at one point. Uh, when was that? Uh, back in 2018. Okay. Oh. oh. Uh, do you know who you checked in with? No, no, I'm not good with names. I just have this guy's card. Okay. Um, Joel, Joel, Joel isn't here right now. Um, let me see. Um, how about this? Um, any chance you could stop by the front desk? I've got some guests waiting on me. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, I suppose so. Yes, yes. Okay. Very good, All right. Very good. In that case. All right. Well, I'll see you at the front desk then, okay? Okay. Bye. All right. Thank you. Bye. I was searching through about 170 pictures on this stupid listing to try to find just a room number. And I thought I saw from an angle that 225 was one of them. I do enjoy the pictures of the uh, homeless encampment just outside of the uh, hotel. That's... That spells safety. That spells like your stuff's going to be well taken care of. Break stuff? Ah, yeah, I was trying to get him. They were concerned a little bit about the cat. He's emotional support, Bobcat. Yeah. Your cat's freaking out every time the Bobcat noise gets made. Well, tell your cat to man the fuck up. Get some balls behind it. Unless you chopped off the balls and then you're just like, hey, whatever. Whatever. And Cass is the type of woman that has cats declawed. She's a disgusting human being. What the fuck? Yeah, you told me that story. That's awful. You said you like to go and save animals from the Humane Society, have them declawed and return them. Oh, wow. So a torture. <laughs> that's, fuck, that's fucked up. Nope, nope. That's not me. Oh, okay. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> I don't mean to, s to spread these slanderous rumors about you. In downtown LA, how can I assist you? Hi, um, can you, can you tell the people over in 213 to quit knocking on my door and complaining about my kitty cat? <laughs> okay, 213? Yeah, I'm in 215, and they're, they're just complaining about my kitty cat making too much noise. So I'm just, I'm just like, oh, it's like, it's okay, like, he'll quiet down, he's got to eat his food, and he'll be fine. And so, like, I don't know what their their major qualm is. Like, the the first few meow meow meows, I like, I know about that. And like, I'm trying to calm them down. Okay, okay, I will let them know. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you, thank you. <laughs> bye bye. Bobcat. <laughs> Bobcat. God damn it. This makes me think of the people who have like charcoal on YouTube. They have what on YouTube? Charcoals. Big wild cat. Oh, oh yeah. I watched one. Like, I don't, I don't know if you know like big flop That's terrible. Oh, that, they, there was one that was like uh, this lady. Like the fucking cat kept uh, escaping her house and uh, getting out into the neighborhoods and stuff. And they had to keep having uh, animal rescue and shit come out and get it. And it was like terrorizing the whole neighborhood. And they're like, all right, well, you're not allowed to have that animal. We have to prove that it is a 100% like a pure bobcat and stuff. And I guess they end up finding out it wasn't 100%. So 
so that she was able to keep it. But then it escaped again. And they're like, all right, bitch. And then they took it from her. Wonder if that lady was a cougar. Oh, we can say some old woman. Some old some old cougar is hitting on me in my room. And then play the song. Tell you, tell you the truth, I'm just trying to get through, I'm just trying to get through the, uh, the the little bit of the show that's left. I'm just I'm just trying. Robert Robert Cat. Because as soon as I'm done, I'm gonna wait to get this downloaded. Nah, I swear to God, I'm gonna go fix some hinges on that fucking that fucking motherfucker. Uh, let's see. Negative cats are the best? What do you mean? Like, having a deficiency in cats? Like, negative pets? It's a little weird, but sure. Hello, King Raj. Ah, 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 there's a bobcat. Ah. Hello? Help me. Help. 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 Crazy. Help. Oh. It's, it's eating my clothes. It's eating my khakis. Like I was like crazy. Crazy. It's crazy. Uh, let's see. I dated cat for years. Most will support the bobcat. Uh, let's just catch up with chat for a quick second. Maybe maybe it's better if I go over here. Let's look. Uh, let's see. Oh, I about said the name, name of the hotel. I'm like that's not good. All right, I'm telling you guys the truth. My eyes are like burning right now. It is, uh, it's not good. So, what I'm gonna do is wait for the voting to end on movie night at the bottom of this hour. We're probably gonna call it right there. Um, like I said I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to stay up to edit this. But I want to give it a shot, a whole college try. Need to go hit hit the uh, Afrin for a second here too. A little stuffy. Eye drops. I don't have any eye drops. I don't usually have that problem. It's not. Thank my, you for it's calling the Dream Team in the city of Inglewood. Enter the room number of the. I shouldn't rub the boba in my eye. Rub some boba in your eye. We're just counting down the... the Amy? What? Hello? Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Okay. I have a, I have a problem. Hi. Who are you? Where are you calling from? I'm calling from inside of the motel. Which which room number are you in? I'm in two fifteen. Uh huh. And I don't like the way your mirror is hung up. So I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move your mirror off of the wall. Why you wanna? I don't understand your part. I'm moving your mirror. I'm moving it in pieces. I, this you want to move the mirror? Yeah, it broke. The mirror broke. Cheap mirror. Cheap, cheap mirror broke. The mirror in the bathroom. Cheap piece of shit mirror. It broke when I touched it. So you damage the uh, you damage inside the property. No, right? no, no. I touched the mirror, and then the mirror just just fell apart. Just fell right. No, right it, it's not fell apart like that. It's I don't understand your point. You know, 
I think you guys uh, made something, the fighting or something like that, or you... No, no. Then how, how is going to be happened? I touched it with my fist. Okay, then you have to pay for it. That's but, it. But why? You broke it, so you have to pay. Yeah, but now you have seven... What do you mean, why? Now you have seven years of bad luck because I broke the mirror. It was a cheap China piece of crab. Where is she right now? Where is the what? checking person. Where is what? The checking person. The lady. The lady? Oh, that's... Uh -huh. That's 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 my woman. That's my bitch. But she's not here right now. She's my pimp. She's my pimp. She she brings women for me to have sex with for money, and then she leaves. Okay, so I'm gonna charge for her uh, credit card, you know? No, well, then don't do that. Why? Why would you do that? Because you guys damaged inside the property, then you have to pay for it. No, it was a, you, you have a cheap. Like it was that. the mirror was cheap. Doesn't matter. It's cheap or whatever. It's uh, how, how are you gonna decide that it's cheap? How are you gonna decide? Uh, the other mirror broke now too. See, it fell. It fell on its own. Broke. Hello, ma'am. Hang on. I'll call her back. I got something else I want to talk to her about. Uh, it looks like Ernest goes to jail is going to win. Probably the next minute or two that'll, that'll finalize. Thank you for calling the Dream Inn in the city of Inglewood. Inglewood always up to no good. Yeah, hi. Now I charge you five hundred dollars because I'm improving my room. You know what? Uh, I don't understand your point, and you're so angry with me. No, I'm not angry. I'm just over here. I'm I'm doing construction on the room, so I gotta charge you money. You charge me money? Yeah, I'm doing construction in here. That's my How wife. That's my you? that's my wife. Oh okay, so oh I'm oh oh oh! Her. I think I hit I think I hit a fire alarm. Oh boy, that's not good. I think I broke something. All right, then I'm gonna. You have to pay for the mirror the mirror removal. The mirror was broke, and I'm removing the shards. You have to pay for the disposal. So get out your checkbook and write me some check money, goddamn you. All right, bye. Where's your husband? <sighs> All right, bye. Damn it. All right, so I'm going to call it right there. The voting's done. Ernest Scare Stupid won by a landslide. We're going to go over to Dwight Court and watch this. Uh, and... Uh, I'm going to try to edit this before I end up passing the fuck out. She's going to pay me. She's going to pay me. Don't, don't, don't worry. She's going to pay for the entire thing. I guarantee you. It's a terrible Trump impression, but whatever. Whatever. I didn't say I was some type of impressionalist or something. So anybody, would anybody like to plug something before we go? Very, very low, low energies. All right, good call, good call. <laughs> All right, let's let's get out of here. We're gonna go to Dwight Court and watch Ernest scared stupid. Oh no, wait, we're gonna watch Ernest goes to jail. Ernest in the army. Ernest cross dresses several times. It's one of the two. It's something like that. Oh, okay. Bye, bye. I'll see you next next week. We we'll do the birthday show next week. I'll try to be on my shit. All right.